So Carrie, um, the thing I want to talk to you about is you're a fighter, your husband's a fighter. Um, what's that like being married to a fighter? <laughs> um, it's, I don't know what it's actually like because I don't know what it's like not being married to a fighter. Um, me and Brandon have a lot of the same uh, things that we do. We are able to go to the gym together, train together, eat good together, run together. So it's just really nice to have somebody um, who has a lot of things in common as I do so that we can, you know, relate to each other's issues and, uh, I don't know, we make it work. It's great, actually. And uh, you said it's great because you guys don't even argue because you come home from training and you just pass out. <laughs> yeah, we don't argue at all. I mean, we're just so tired by the time we get home, you know, and we just let the little things go. Nothing's really worth arguing over. And uh, for you, you had a... Uh, what was your first pro MMA fight recently? Yeah. For Bellator? Yes. Um, what was that like, getting in the cage for the first time? Um, I've had a lot of boxing fights and kickboxing fights, so it wasn't that different. The gloves were just a little bit smaller. Um, the only real difference was that I was a little hesitant to kick because of the takedown, and then you go to the ground, you know, MMA is just everything. So um, it, it was a little different in the sense that I think I held back when I should have just gone for it a little bit more, but it was a ton of fun. And you weren't, you weren't odd by, you know, being in front of a big crowd, you've done that before, you've been on TV before. Yeah, and, uh, the big, big crowds have never worried me, I'm, you know, I'm in there for me, I want to do the best that I can do, and everybody else is just kind of there at that, at that moment, you know, so mm -hmm. that never has bothered me. Okay, so back to uh, being married to a fighter. What does he do to, to keep things, uh, Romantic. Does he take you out on, you know, special dates? What, what, yes. What's the deal? Tell me how, how a fighter takes care of his, his girl. <laughs> he, he does a lot for me. He's very sweet. He always says very sweet things. Um, he does a lot of little things. Um, he pays attention to stuff. He's always complimenting me. And, yes, we do go on dates every week. Uh, usually dinner. It's usually an early night. But, you know, I'm tired, too, so it doesn't bother me at all. And uh, you guys have had this gym for two years now? Is that right? About two years, yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's... Huge. It's awesome. It's a nice gym, yeah. It sounds like almost all the top fighters come through here at some point. Yeah, very popular with all the fighters. A lot of the fighters come here and get together and train. The fighter training here is very good. And you get a lot of good women fighters out here too? Just a few, just a handful. Uh, I'd say probably about four that come consistently when one of us has a fight. But other than that, girls are hard to, hard to come by. So. Yeah. Did you watch uh, Gina and Cyborg fight on Saturday? And what do you think? Um. I don't know. I did watch Gina. I was actually there in San Jose. Um, you know, she just had a lot of courage to just get in there in the first place and fight Cyborg. I mean, you know, Cyborg is still, I don't know. I don't want to say too much, but um, I just, I think that was cool that she had the courage to go in there and do it, so good for her. Did, did it, uh, you know, a female fighter, did it make you feel good to see them put 13,000 people in there and huge ratings on Showtime. Of course, yeah, it was the first biggest women's MMA fight out there, so it was really cool to see women get the respect that, that we deserve, you know, as fighters. I don't think there's been a bigger women's fight in boxing, kickboxing, or anything. I don't think so. I think this was a, a pretty big fight. They promoted the crap out of it. Yeah, they did. <laughs> yeah, they did. Well, Carrie, I appreciate you taking the time, and you did great on the interview. Thank you.